I think one of the challenges is that the students need to understand uh, programming as well as electronics at the same time. For me, the problem I face when I conduct the task is mostly trying to troubleshoot why the circuit didn't work. And so it takes a lot of time, especially when you have 20 students in a class, you know, and maybe like half of them have this problem, so we need to go through the same process. I don't need to check my program, is it correct or not? I just look at the LED and I know my coding is correct or wrong. So the old Arduino Uno, one of the biggest problems we always face is that when we teach them programming, it got mixed up with circuit also. So if something doesn't work, the kids might not know whether it's programming doesn't work or the circuit doesn't work. I was really impressed with the idea that uh, the Maker Uno allows people to actually do programming right away. It you know, allows you to learn how to do Arduino programming straight away without the hassle or like the amount of time needed to actually learn electronics first. We actually prepared a comprehensive kind of teacher manual for the teachers to use. We narrow it down to whatever they need to know, plus a little bit more, so they can guide the students to learn this new exciting content in the syllabus. And we also welcome any effort to translate the language of the module to any languages that see fit. Kami faham masalah yang dihadapi oleh cikgu ketika mereka mengajar topik Arduino di dalam kelas. Sebab itu kami reka Maker Uno ini. Kami berharap Maker Uno ini dapat menyelesaikan masalah mereka dan jadikan topik Arduino lebih mudah dan menarik untuk semua.